come and see. Hey guys, so today we're at the beach and I'm starting this tutorial off using sunscreen that is waterproof so our skin will stay safe. Next I'll be taking Maybelline's Bad to the Bronze color tattoo and applying it all over my upper lid and lower half of my lower lash line. I'll be using my fingers if that's okay with you guys. They're clean so it'll do. This cream shadow is especially great for the beach because it is waterproof so that's a great plus. Then I'm going to take my EOS Super Hydrating SPF lip balm and apply it all over my lips. Using Zodiac from Urban Decay's Moon Dust line, I'm going to dust this everywhere I put the cream shadow, which is the upper lid and half of the lower lash line. This really reminds me of like a Savage Beauty Victoria's Secret photo shoot kind of makeup. It's really pretty and it may be a little bit too much for some of you guys, but if you like to look extra fancy on the beach, then this is for you. Then I'm going to take a waterproof eyeliner from Urban Decay and align my lower, my upper lash line. And I'm going to line my lower lash line halfway. Some of you can definitely skip that step, but you know, I just like to go all out. And I'm going to put a little bit more of the um, Zodiac on the outer corners of my eyes. For a dewy, flushed kind of look, I'm going to take Tarte's Cheek Stain in Tipsy and just pat it onto my cheeks. For the lips, I'm using Juice Beauty in Pink Gloss, and it's made with sesame seed oil to heal and antioxidants to nourish your lips with a high shine. For the hair, I'm taking Numi's Finishing Serum and applying it all over my hair. Because beach waves are super hot, but dry, brittle hair is definitely not. So we're going to nourish and protect our hair with this finishing serum. Um, by applying this Numi serum to your hair, your hair is going to look shinier and healthier. It looks a lot better. Then we're going to go ahead and take Zoya nail polish, and this is a jackal. And I'm just going to paint my nails, and I'm not the best at painting my nails. I'm going to admit that, but I'm definitely working on it. Are any of you guys like as bad as me or working on the nail thing. I'm so into nail polish now, but I'm just not that great. Anyways, I'm taking Pacifica Coconut Crush Pearl Bronzing Butter, and I'm going to apply that all over my body. And I actually have a faux tan on, and it evened out that faux tan, so I love this stuff. Then I'm going to take a fragrance, not a perfume, and spray it all over because I think fragrances are light and refreshing. So this is the final look, and I don't think it was too bad. What do you think? Before I leave you, I have a special giveaway for you. I'll be at Generation Beauty June 1st through 2nd, and I'm super excited to see all of you guys. I really want you to come with me. If you're not sure what Generation Beauty is, you can always go to the link. It's genbeauty.com to check it out. It's going to be like the biggest beauty lover slash blogger vlogger event this year. I'll be doing a meet and greet at the OPI booth and also a workshop there on how to create your first video and get your first fan. Okay, so the giveaway rules. All you have to do is be subscribed to my channel, leave a comment letting me know you want to go to Generation Beauty, and like this video. After that, I'll pick five lucky winners, and you get to take a friend with you to Generation Beauty for free. I will see you there, and I can't wait to give you both big hugs. I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it for you. Until the next video, bye dollies. Just come a little closer. We can take it slow